Hello, esteemed viewers. Welcome to our mathematics tutorial for today. In today's tutorial question, we are going to solve an Olympiad exam question. We are asked to solve for x if x to the power of x to the power of 6 is equal to 144. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and also remember to hit the bell icon to be notified whenever I upload my latest mass Olympiad content as your exams draws ever more closer. Now let's look at this question. If we are given this question, the first thing that should come to your mind is to simplify the left hand side, uh, the right hand side, which is uh, 144. And when you do that, we will now think of reducing this exponent. So let's do that first. We'll reduce, we are going to simplify that part and then reduce the exponent. Now, if we simplify that part, remember uh, 12, 144 will be 12 squared, right? 12 squared will give us 144. So we'll have our x to the power of x to the power of 6 is equal to 12 squared. Good. Now, for us to simplify further, to get an accurate solution. I want you to think first, what do you think we'll do? Haven't gotten to this part. Some will decide to, it's not be easy to think out what we'll do, but uh, in this aspect, what we'll now do is, we are going to uh, multiply both sides by the exponent of six. Now let's multiply both sides by the exponent of six. We are heading somewhere if we do that. All multiply by the exponent of 6 equal to uh, 12 to the power of 2 multiplied by the exponent of 6. Now, if we do that, I want you to also remember a rule in indices that if you have x to the power of a all to the power of b, this can be equal to x to the power of b to the power of a and both can be equal to x to the power of a multiplied by b remember that so if we apply that here remembering that this can be uh, a and this will be a uh, b so if we apply that rule here we're going to have we're going to have uh, x to the power of 6 to be raised to the power of x to the power of 6, right? And this will be equal to, apply this rule here, this will give us 12 to the power of uh, 6 times 2 is 12. So what do you notice? You come to notice that we'll have same power, a similar power, and similar base. This is how you go about solving questions like this. So since we have similar power and similar base, we are going to take one. So our x to the power of 6 is equal to our 12. Now we've arrived to this point. What do we do? Now some will consider uh, taking the sixth root of both sides. If you consider that, then you can be absolutely correct. Now let's look at taking the sixth root of both sides. So if we take the sixth root of both sides, we're going to have um, the sixth root of x, the sixth root of x to the power of six um, equal to the sixth root of 12. So this will clear this, and then we'll have our x so be equal to the sixth root of 12. I remember the sixth root of 12 can be equal to 12 to the power of 1 divided by what? 6. So this stands as a solution to that exponential equation. Now I want us to do something. Let's test if the solution we have preferred is absolutely Correct. Right. What's the question we are giving? We are told that x to the power of x to the power of 6 should be equal to 144. 
x to the power of x to the power of 6 must be equal to 144. So we must find the value of this. Now let's insert that value. We have our 12 to the power of 1 divided by 6 all to the power of 12 divided by 1 divided by 6 all to the power of 6. Is it going to give us 144? Now let's do that. If we simplify this following the law of indices, we'll have uh, 12 to the power of 1 divided by 6 multiplied by 12 to the power of 1 divided by 6 multiplied by 6. This will clear this. And then what we have remaining is 12 to the power of 1 divided by 6 or multiplied by 12. Now, following the law of indices, the exponents we can still multiply. We we'll have our 12 to the power of 1 divided by 6 multiplied by 12. So this will clear here 1. This will be 2. So we're going to have our 12 to the power of to the power of 2. And 12 to the power of 2 is equal to 144. So we see. The solution to that question, x equal to uh, 1 divided by 6, is absolutely what? Correct. I know you do enjoy this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel for more simplified uh, mass Olympiad solution video. I remember to share this video with friends and colleagues alike. Thanks. And bye-bye for now.